Hey, what's going on, everybody? Hey, Kaya. I'm really happy to be here right now. Uh, we came in for the Great Hanging Commemoration events, which is about the history of Gainesville, Texas. This is the town that uh, your daddy grew up in. I was born in Denison, Kaya, and then I came to Gainesville. This is your, uh, this is your great great grandmother's grave. So this is my great grandmother, Alma Elizabeth Gilliam, married E. W. Wiggins. So it's really fascinating. This is my great grandmother. My mother was Mary Lou, uh, made a name Dusick. She married my dad Underwood, became Mary Lou Underwood. She was the daughter of my grandmother, Marjorie Dusick. Who, she married my grandfather, Joe Dusick, but she originally was a Wiggins. My grandmother was a Wiggins, but her mother, my great-grandmother, was Alma Gillian. This is your great-great-grandmother. She died when Marjorie, when my grandmother was two, Alma died in 1928. So she was raised with her father's name, Wiggins. She took her father's name, Wiggins, um, and she was raised by another woman. And that woman who I always thought growing up on Bond Street, I'll show you guys the house on Bond Street with the woman I thought, DG, was my great grandmother. This is the house right here. Bond is sculling. It's where my, who I thought was my great grandmother, DG, used to live. But this is the woman that raised my grandmother, Marjorie. My real great grandmother, Alma Elizabeth, died. My grandmother was two. They really expanded that house, but that's it right there, baby. I thought that was your great great grandmother, but it turns out Alma Gilliam uh, was actually my great grandmother. And once I unlocked that knowledge of that history that had been hidden, um, or it wasn't completely hidden because I grew up knowing about the Howith name here in Gainesville, Texas. There's a Howith Street, and we're going to make our way over here. So, this is my great grandmother. Let's move over here to, to the uh, other plot real quick. So here we are, so this is, Kaya, this is your great, great, great grandmother, Betty Fidelia Howitt, and your great, great, great grandfather, Charles James. So this is my second great grandmother. This is Alma Elizabeth's mother, my great, great grandmother, and my cousin, Elizabeth Shepard, who's helped learn so much history and is generously working the camera now. That's her great grandmother, my great great grandmother, and Kaya's great 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 grandmother, Betty Fidelia Howith. So Betty Fidelia Howith um, gave birth to Alma, uh, Alma Elizabeth. Now let's move right over here. This is. But Betty. Alma died before a a Alma the mother and father. Correct. Yes, correct. Alma died before her mother. This is a part of the history that's messed up because when Alma died. And my grandmother was raised by DG. DG never wanted her. My aunt told me that DG never wanted my grandmother to know her grandmother, um, which was my great great grandmother. Uh, she never wanted her to know her. So my she died two years before my mom was born. And I just think it's so sad that from what uh, 1928, 1930. My grandmother had no interaction with her grandmother because of that history. So this is this is the very fascinating Kaya, this is your great 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 great. This is your fourth great grandmother. This is my great 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 grandmother, my third great grandmother, and my third great grandfather, Harvey Howitt, right? So Susan Amelia Dorset, she was born June 11th, 1829 in the Anascocito district of Mexican, Texas. She was born two years before the law of immigration outlawed legal Anglo immigration to Mexican, Texas. So she was actually a dreamer. She was born a Mexican before the secession of Texas became the independent Republic of Texas. And um, she is actually the descendant of the Piscataways of Mary Keita McCoon, but this is her husband, my great 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 grandfather, and come on down. He was a master mason by the way, uh, Harvey Howitt. And this this was his father. This was his father. This is my fourth great grandfather. This is the patriarch of the family, Thomas Howitt. As you can see the master mason still up here. He was a master mason. Kaya, this is your fifth great grandfather. 
right here, Thomas Howarth. One day you can see this. This is one of your one of your many ancestors, your fifth great grandfather. He was a master mason. He gave this plot of land. Look at the original tombstone over here. So this whole cemetery, Fairview Cemetery, you see the mason symbol. This cemetery was given um, by the family after these infant died in a tornado. It says right here, in memory of Thomas B. and Louisa Howitt, born 1843, and then later died one year old. They were killed in the tornado of May 1854. This Anyways, they were your age. This baby was your age when the tornado killed it. Isn't that crazy? This is my cousin, my second cousin, Elizabeth Shepard, kind of cousin. So thankful to her. She's the reason we know the, the reason I know the Piscataway history because she connected us with our relatives. You've taken the ball and really run with it. Taking the ball you. and run with it. We're we're running. <laughs> the Howarth Family Cemetery. Uh, they were killed by a tornado in 1854. And of course, this cemetery was outside the city limits. And uh, for a number of years, it was the Howarth Family Cemetery. And then later, Howarth, as a, a Christian charity, gave the cemetery to the county. And the county had the cemetery for about 10 years and then they gave it to the city in a 999 year lease. So I don't know what happens when the 999 year <laughs> lease runs out. We won't worry about this that structure right we call a false crypt because a true crypt, the coffin would be above ground and it's the two coffins are below ground. And uh, so the Great Hanging occurred in 1862, so this was a new cemetery, really. And everybody that's buried here that had something to do with the Great Hanging were on the side of the hangers, not the hangees. Since How William How right here was on the Great Hanging jury, and his brother Harvey was part of the local militia and they sh he shot one of the convicted ones that was supposed to hang. He tried to escape this doctor and Harvey House shot him. And uh, so this is the this is the earliest plot 